Well, Justin, we're here to talk old timer again, and we're going to talk specifically about another couple product lines that you're introducing this year. And uh, one of which, the one we're going to start with is the generational series. And this is one that when I think about the epitome of old timer, it kind of reflects on. Um, if you were to go from farmstead to farmstead here in the Midwest, you're probably going to find an old timer knife sitting on top of the dresser or just inside the drawer. Uh, specifically myself, I've got one that was handed down to me by my great-grandfather, and I, I keep it in my pocket quite often. So this series, the generational series, actually kind of plays on that storyline with Old Timer. Why don't you tell us a little bit more about the generational series? Sure. So the generational series, we wanted to keep up the quality that is consistent with the Old Timer branding. Um, so we're releasing a 152OT sharp finger fixed blade knife. This is kind of a staple point to yeah. Old Timer. So it's made out of a 1095 high carbon steel, and then the handle is bone saw cut style. Um, it's also gonna come with a leather sheath, and then along with the generational series, there's gonna be three uh, folding knives, and they're also gonna feature the 1095 steel and bone handle. Very cool. Well, I say with the folding series, I've definitely seen those come out of a lot of pockets, whether it's at the local cafe or, or you know, cleaning your nails while you're working cattle. Uh, but I've also seen the uh, fixed blade knife hooked onto a lot of leather belts in this country as well. So it's very good to see that you guys are going back to your roots and really speaking kind of the heritage of the company and, and I guess you would say our lifestyle. Yeah, exactly. And along with these knives, we're also going to release a generational gift box. The, the gift box is going to contain a generational log. Um, obviously, these knives, since our, the beginning of our brand, mm -hmm. um, they were built to be passed down. So we're going to increase or include a log in this generational gift box to you, where you can track who passed down the knife. Oh, that's you. very cool. Well, we'll appreciate that. Well, uh, you know, in talking about the generational series, let's go on ahead and move on to the Heritage series, which is the second line we're talking about today. The Heritage series, it's going to include a laminate wood handle, and then the steel is also going to be D2, which is a high-quality steel. So we're going to have the fixed blade knife, and then also the three folding knives with those. Very good. So um, in both series, we're going to have two folders, three folders, I'm sorry, and a fixed blade. So folks, there you have it. You're going back to the roots of old timer. I can't think of a better brand to put in your pocket and carry around. Well, Justin, we've covered a couple new product lines already with Old Timer. And, uh, you know, we started with the, the camp kit and the field dressing kit, a new modern look on that good old Old Timer quality. And then we rolled right into that, that heritage of the brand with the generational series and then the heritage series, uh, which is going to make it kind of natural for us to go into this next category. And uh, with this next category of new products, you guys are going to kind of lean on, I would say, the soul of a man, and you're going to introduce power to your line. So why don't you tell us a little bit about what's right here in front of us? So we're kind of branching into a new category here with Old Timer. We have the electric game knives that we're coming out with. We have the lithium ion powered version and then the 110 volt version. So you're introducing power into the game processing product lines. Why don't you tell us a little bit about the specific features and benefits of each of these offerings? Yeah, so they're, they're pretty much the same. There's a few key differences in there. We can start with the lithium ion version. The lithium ion version is gonna have a visible battery meter built in here at the bottom. It's gonna have an ergonomic hand design um, just for effortless cutting. It's gonna have a nine inch stainless steel blade, okay. trigger guard, and then blade release here at the top. Very easily. Does that come with extra blades or will you guys sell blades as an accessory item on the back end? It does not come with extra blades. Okay, but you will have it as an accessory item. Yes. Okay, very good. Well, let's talk about the electrical version. What, what's different there versus the battery? So the, the difference here is um, obviously the battery, mm -hmm. but then the 110 volt version is gonna come with a seven inch Seven Stainless blade. steel blade, yes. Okay, very good. Now, are those blades interchangeable just in case some guy feels like he needs the battery addition and the, the AC power? Yes. Okay, very good. So you will have aftermarket blade packages uh, for sale for these both these products as well, right? Yes. Okay. So talk to me a little bit about price point. Where are you guys coming into the marketplace price point? Yeah, so we feel the price point's very important on these items. So on the lithium-ion version, we're going to come in at $79.99. Okay. And then the 110 volt version, we're going to come in at $49.99. Again, quality at an affordable price. Exactly. So can't beat that. Well, what about availability? Availability, it'll be available in April of this year. Well, folks, there you have it. These are the new electric game processing knives from Old Timer. Justin, we appreciate it. Take care, buddy. Looking forward to seeing all these new products. Thanks for having me.